Good morning, it's raining again. I have some research to do for today's meeting, but I have packed up gifts that I got for my colleagues. I got them wine and chocolate. And what better way to lift my spirits than by unboxing not one, not two, but three of my advent calendar items. Look at this tiny little number seven, you guys. Uh, this, I hope that this is a lip butter. I don't know how they could possibly fit anything else in this box. Number seven says, collect a litter at your local park or wild place. Feel good, enjoy that air. Number eight says, send a surprise Christmas card to a neighbor. Make everybody feel together. And number nine says, sign up today to volunteer at your local care home food bank, women's refuge, or homeless shelter. Obviously, these are suggestions for if you are able to do these things, then please do them. Seven, eight, and nine. Number seven, I think feels like a tiny little lip butter. So let's see out of three if I'm gonna get any of these. <laughs> oh, <gasps> it is, oh my God, oh my gosh. Okay, I am correct that it is lip butter. But am I happy with the flavor? No. It's coconut. I don't do coconut anything. The taste is gross. The smell makes me feel nauseous. I just, I don't do coconut. I'm gonna have to throw this one in. Maybe, oh, yeah. Since I have like gifts wrapped for people, I might as well like, I might as well throw one in there for my work colleague because I got him a bottle of wine and I'm giving him a plant that I propagated and a chocolate but I'm sure he'll like lip butter you can never have enough of this lip butter, especially not from the body shop it's so good okay we have a plan and then number eight feels very light I'm gonna say this is an accessory of some sort and not an actual beauty product so it's gonna be like a hairband or a loofah, I don't know, another sponge, I don't know. But like, you know, along those lines where it's not like a product, like a face cream or anything like that. Because it feels really light. So, let's see. Can we get two out of three? <gasps> we can get two out of three! Okay, okay. This, what do they call this? What is, what is it? It doesn't have a name, but it's, it looks like it's some kind of a body sponge, right? Put your soap... And then scrub and it feels like yeah it actually does oh it feels like it would be a very nice body scrub so that's pretty cool kind of got two out of three there i'm gonna take it i'm gonna take the win and then lastly number nine today's item this feels heavy so i'm going to keep guessing shampoo for a heavy box until i get shampoo so let's see what is this guys i'm wrong I'm wrong. I got a hydrating bath foam. I got this last year and I only used it once. It doesn't lather well enough, like the, it doesn't give me enough bubbles, you know, if that makes sense, even though it is a bath foam. I don't know why. It just didn't give me enough bubbles, but I guess I'm gonna have to use it this year. Yeah, this is something I've gotten before and it's not something I'm crazy about. So that's kind of a bummer. And again, it's not shampoo, so I'm wrong. I got two out of three, which, I mean, let's be real, it's still something because I've gotten everything else wrong. I will take that little bit of a win. Good morning, guys. Happy Wednesday. Happy Vlogmas Day 9. Yes, it's Wednesday the 8th. It's Vlogmas Day 9. So with my previous video that you guys saw, you obviously know I'm not feeling the greatest. Tuesday, yesterday, was supposed to be this like big sad day. But things actually kind of didn't end up going to plan. I still had to go to the airport. I still had to hand in my stuff. But the plan had to change. Things had to happen earlier. I was not prepared for it. I did film it. So I'm just going to insert the footage here. I am not prepared for this. I'm not prepared for today at all. Today is Monday. And you guys are currently watching my um, throwback vlog tomorrow you guys will be watching um, the short video that i prepared about how today i have to go in and hand in all of my flight attendant items 
um, and kind of say goodbye to that because that's what I'm meant to be doing tomorrow, Tuesday. But like I said, it's currently Monday and I just spoke to my manager and basically because of COVID, everyone has to be separated. We want to be safe. So they can't have every single pilot and flight attendant in the office at once. So today I'm going to have to go in and hand in my stuff. <sighs> I'm not prepared. Not prepared for this at all. Um, I'm not prepared for it logistically because now I have to leave the office early and go back home and pack everything because I literally haven't even packed my uniform away or anything like that. So I have to get everything together, pack it all up and then drive all the way to the airport before two o'clock because that's the cutoff time to hand my stuff in. And I'm also not prepared emotionally, which I never will be, let's be real, but I kind of had it in my head this whole time, like, okay, you're gonna do this on Tuesday, <laughs> prepare for Tuesday to be a cry fest or something, but now it's today, which could be a good thing as well, because like I said, I'm not prepared, so I might just breeze right through it and only realize what's happening later, because I just have things to do now. I have one more thing that absolutely has to be done today in the office before I leave but I need to try to get out of here in the next hour, hour and a half and yeah, kind of just say goodbye which is really, really, really sad but I'm going to try not to think too hard about it Plus tomorrow, Tuesday, we actually have our office Christmas party here so Hopefully being here and being a part of that is going to lift my spirits a bit. But yeah, I'm I'm really trying not to think about it right now. I'm really just trying to just get through the day. But on a positive note, one of our, is it our clients, I want to say, left myself and my colleague a Christmas present. He got us little gift cards to checkers, which we know I love shopping for food doing little grocery hauls so this is nice this is literally the perfect gift for me it's just a gift card so that I can buy whatever I want with it do you know what though as much as Monday sucked I actually really appreciate that it happened earlier I appreciate that because I kind of had it in my mind like Tuesday Tuesday's the big day Tuesday's the day I have to say goodbye like I was mentally and emotionally prepared for Tuesday and then Monday morning comes and my manager's like, no, you, you guys have to come in today. Like, there is no other option. And I was like, uh... <laughs> so it was nice because I didn't have a chance to think about it. I kind of just had to do it. I kind of... And I was so busy. I had to get stuff done at the office before I left the office. I had to drive home to actually pack up my uniform and pack up all of my required items to take... To the airport then I had to drive all the way across it was just a whole thing but also the main thing that I appreciate is that I got to spend some time with a couple of my friends from my airline so I actually drove there with one of them and then um, I saw a couple of people we got to chat and then even after we handed our stuff in I hung out with Tash at her house for like a couple of hours and I just appreciate that so much because it makes such a difference to hang out with somebody who fully 100% understands the situation. Other people can sympathize, other people can feel for you, but it's completely different to just hanging out with somebody who's also in it, just like you. And it's not like we spent the entire couple of hours talking about the situation. No, we were like catching up on life and what's been happening because we haven't hung out in a couple of months. So that alone was just so needed because I feel like the worst thing would have been for me to go there alone, hand in my stuff and then drive home alone by myself and then just be alone with my thoughts. That would have been the worst. So I'm okay. I'm actually doing okay. I feel like the last couple of years have been so stressful and with all of the up and down of the aviation industry anyway from COVID, I kind of was already prepared for this. Like, don't get me wrong, it still sucks. It definitely still sucks and having to go through that was terrible, but I am okay. Yesterday on Tuesday, I got to fully enjoy the Christmas party at the office. I'm going to add those clips in now. 
it's Tuesday now. It's the day of our office Christmas party. So even though I don't feel fantastic, I thought I would try to look more festive. I would have worn the green dress that I bought a couple of vlogs ago, but that's in the laundry. So instead I'm wearing my red, it's like a jersey cotton red dress. I like the little bows on the sleeve and I just added a random like green belt so that I look a bit more festive. You know, I feel like I look like Christmas right now, kind of actually. <laughs> Yay! Christmas presents. It was, it actually ended up being such a fun day. And like, you guys know, like, I love Christmas, especially like the Santa and the Christmas tree and the Christmas presents of it all. Like, I'm obsessed with that. So, it lifted my spirits, I must say. And also, it was a busy day for me again. I was running around helping to organize the party. It kept me busy. I didn't have time to be like in my thoughts about everything. So, I really appreciate that. We got to leave work early yesterday. I went to the gym in the afternoon because I I knew I needed it. I literally just did 30 minutes on the treadmill. Yeah. But I'm gonna shut up now because it's raining and I need to drive to work. It was my colleague's last day in the office because he has other things going on. I'm still gonna go in tomorrow, but yeah, today was a fairly busy day, I must say. People just drive so crazy here. Again, I'm just glad to be busy. I'm glad to have other things to focus on. I got to help in the jewelry. I have a ton of things to send out before my last day tomorrow, which honestly might probably be extended to Friday. So when I get home, I really need to get on that. I don't know what I'm gonna do with myself and I don't have to come into the office anymore. And while I'm in traffic, I thought I would just end this vlog because I don't want this vlog to go on for too long because I have things to get done when I get home tonight. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. I will see you tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 10. I cannot believe we're already on the 10th day of Vlogmas. Before I close this vlog out, I just want to say thank you all very, very much. I've seen all of your comments. I've been browsing through them throughout the day. I will respond probably when I get home. But I really appreciate you guys sending me kind messages. And just, you know, just the kindness that I've been getting on my channel today is really really heartwarming and very much needed i must say so yeah thank you guys very much um sorry i'm too busy driving like a maniac thank you for watching please continue spreading good vibes and being kind and i'll see you all for tomorrow's upload bye